Good evening to you, sir. Good evening, my brother. How are you? I'm fine, sir. I, I can see you are so excited about the Arsenal game today. Well, quite, quite excited. Quite. Okay. Uh, I'd like to get your thoughts on the match. What are your thoughts on this game today? Um, this game today is good. The boys played very well. The, the, tactically, they were quite sound. They played very well. I, I believe they play according to the instruction of the coach. And that's why they are doing well. Except for maybe like uh, uh, Harvest, you know. He, he's a good player, no doubt. But they need to sit back and know the Arsenal pattern of game, you know. He has to know how to position himself at the right position for the ball to come to him. Today, he was not well positioned. Even when he was well positioned, he's not used to Arsenal that kind of game. He would have scored a goal today. He could not score. Okay, okay. now, um, judging from the confidence of Arsenal, this team, this uh, in this uh, match, how far do you see them going in this Champions League? Well, you know, the thing that prepare players are, the players, consistency. When players start having injury, you know, sometimes players build their confidence on the other players. With the good thing the other one is playing, it will make you have confidence. If Arsenal continue in this way without having much injury, they will go far. I, I know they will have injury, but let it be not the time that will destabilize the game. Like what happened to Timba? You know, Timba set into the game. Yes, yes. Uh -huh. yes. And as he set it into the game, he, he never struggled to set into the game. Yes, yes. But he got that injury, and that injury, you know, other players have to wake up to meet up what they have to do in the defense. But if this, the, the defense line of Arsenal is constant, that is good, they will go far. The attack is good, the attack is quite good. They don't, they play. A coordinated kind of football, you know. I like what they do today. Okay. And I, I that's nice. Go far. That's nice. Um, I also like to ask, you know, Arsenal have really come a long way under Mikel Arteta. Yeah. I can remember how things were rough for them some seasons ago, yeah. and yeah. things has really transformed. What do you really think? What What are the things you are pointing at that Arteta really did to bring back the confidence of the boys? Good. What Arteta has done is to bring, you know, Arteta was once an Arsenal Play. player. Yes. You know. And he has gone to Man City. He sees the way they play. He sees the way Arsenal play. He's now building on that understanding. I think that should bring more of good understanding. And he shouldn't, like, maybe he should just accept the player for a particular game. Like, this player is doing well, he will be good for this game. That's what matters. A player can be doing well, but on a particular game, he may not be doing well. If you look at the other opponent, tactically, you see that maybe that opponent, they are faster. And this one is not faster. It's not fast. So you introduce people that will back the, the, the speed of the, the opponent. <laughs> Another thing is, not because uh, Ateta has bought Harvest, and uh, he thinks that uh, people will blame him if he's not, if he's not playing. As Afes is a good player, but he needs to really get deep into the game to understand what Arsenal is doing. He's like a minus for now. That is what I'm saying Ateta should do. He should not look at Afes. He should bring players that knows what he wants them to do. He shouldn't be sentimental about it. But the end point is if he's having results, it is the glory of the team. And they will not say, uh, because half did not play. Um, no. When you play at half result, the most important thing is results. And good game. Arsenal is doing for good game. If anybody is not playing well, you, you make him sit down and know what to do. Tell him what to do and make him to play well. That is it. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, sir, I need to also ask this last question. Um, now, who would you say is your best player in today's match? Because I know every player in Manchester in uh, Arsenal was exceptional. Who would you say is your best player for this match? Man, <laughs> I saw the guy. The guy was too good. Wow, he really scored a superb goal. He scored, he scored goal, and if you check his passes, his passes, all his passes was accurate. Then the second person will say Saka. Saka was good. Then the third person will give it to the guy Rice. He's good. He's good. He plays well, he positions well, he marks well. Uh -huh. It was a massive performance. It was a good performance. All right, thank you very much. I appreciate it's you for your time. That person is Saliba. William Saliba, William the Almighty Saliba Defender. Is, is, is good. <laughs> it's perfect. It's perfect. I pray he should continue without injury. Thank you very much. All right, thank you very much. I